do y'all? Bread Tuck Rob, Bread Tuck Legacy, man. Check this out, man. Black Lightning Season 3, I believe, Episode 8, man. And as you know, man, I, after every episode, man, I'm dropping consistently, baby. That's what I do. But check this out, man. The episode starts with Tobias. He's doing like a confessional. He's talking into the camera or whatnot. He lets them know. He lets the ASA know, hey, y'all got me shackled up. Y'all got me chained up. But I'm not one of these little meta humans out here, man. I'm more powerful than them. You know, he goes into some dialogue about that, but pretty much to let the people know that, hey, man, this this you, this is in bison. You remember, you remember uh, the game Street Fighter after you got through all the underbosses and all the flunkies or whatever? You had to, and bison was waiting for you at the end. That boy said he in bison. The boy gonna hit you with that flying tornado, man. But check this out, man. Um, Lynn, he's talking to Lynn, man. And Lynn is just so strung out on green light and Lynn needs to buy you know in the past few episodes they've been having this go this back and forth you know and they're about to form some alliance that makes them both will makes Lynn uncomfortable but um Tobias pretty much lets Lynn know that like, hey man you gonna have these people hooked on green light check this out man Uncle Gamby and Anessa man uh, Anessa's getting better you know in the few past few episodes for about three weeks to a month, man. It was like Anessa was dying. But Gamby has his needle and he's like, look, I'm going to poke this in you. Let me see if you tell me what you feel. And she was like, man, I just feel pressure. So she's getting her power back. And, um, you know, Uncle Gamby's like, look, man, you need to rest, you know, and heal up. And, and you know, and that's like, Uncle Gammy, you know, ain't nobody doing all that. I got to get back out here to the people, man. And Uncle Gammy's like, look, man, I knew you was going to say that, man. Uh, you know, we, we, we got to go see about, you know, Black Lightning and everything. You know, every, every people out here tripping, man. Speaking of my boy Black Lightning, man, my boy Jefferson Pierce is in his house doing his own thing. And uh, the, the, the police chief, my boy Carter, rolled up on him. And, you know, he was like, look, man, check this out, man. I know last time we saw each other, we wasn't on good terms. We was doing our Malcolm and Martin thing. And, you know, we was going to do, do, do our own separate thing. But check this out, man. We got to come together. You know why? We got to come together. Our old teacher, Miss uh, Stafford, the ASA is trying to throw her up out of her apartment or whatnot. And we can't have that. And Jefferson Pierce is like, hold on, wait. What? Man, let's go see. Man, that's Miss, that's Miss Stafford, man. Let's go see about Miss Stafford, man. They gonna run up on Miss Stafford. Now check this out. This boy Braxton Hartnerbrig is out there with the ASA. They're about to barricade. They're about to bam uh, come through her door. And you know uh, uh, Carter and them like, hey man, give us give us ten minutes, man. That's our teacher, man. Let me talk to her for ten minutes. And and that boy Car uh, that boy Braxton like, nah, hey man, you got five. So my boy Jefferson Pierce goes in there, and let me tell you something, man. Let me tell you what I love about Miss Stafford. Miss Stafford had that thing, man. She had that thing. She ain't scared of nobody, man. And, and, and she had a revolver. You know, she old school. I like revolvers, man. But check this out, man. Um, um, sp man, man speaking of, man, I like revolvers. I don't usually show my guns like that there, man. But I'm, I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to put that thing away, man. Got to protect the fam. You know, but that's just the entry. That's just, that's just the entry gun. You know, I'm going to leave that where it's at. But check this out, man. Um, there's a Pierce comes up in there, man. And you know, she growing that weed. She got all kind of weed up in that thing, man. Miss man, Miss Stafford got that gun, that ganja up in there. And and uh, and, and Jefferson Pierce like, Miss Stafford, you still out here selling. And, and Miss Stafford like, man, I'm a teacher, man. You know, we don't make enough, man. I got I, I to gotta get what I need, baby. And then, uh, you know, Jefferson Pierce pretty much like, look, Miss Stafford, look, you know they're going to come in here, they're going to hurt you. It's just an apartment. Look, we, we care about you. Just just, just, just uh, give in to what they want. Um, and and Miss Stafford say, look, Jefferson Pierce, I love you, baby. With all due respect, check this out. I know they hurt you. I saw that video when they whipped you on camera. You chose not to do nothing. See, them old, them old schools know how to strike a chord with you, man. She said... You chose not to do something. But me, I'm fighting for mine. And you know what? She had a gun, which which gives me, which which kind of explains my beef that I had with the movie Queen and Slim, man. Why they why they on the run? They got uh they're they're fugitives and they got people checking for them. There's a bounty on their head, but they don't have no gun. 
they get rid of the anyway, you'll have to go see that movie. But anywho, after that, uh Jesse Pierce hits my boy Carter and he's like, hey man, get the get the team together, man. We're going to war. Then that boy turns into Black Lightning because he knew that Miss Miss Carter not gonna leave. So we gotta protect, we gotta protect ain't nobody finna ain't nobody finna hurt Miss Carter. But check this out, man. Um, but uh uh Jennifer, Jennifer and that boy Lloyd, man. You know, Lloyd looking for uh looking for Miss um I forget the uh doctor's name that works with Lynn. She looking, he's looking for her because you know, supposedly she killed his parents or something like that or whatever did an experiment. Anyway, um, and you know, Lynn, Lynn uh, they found out that, Lynn, they found out that um, Jennifer balances Lloyd. So when his power gets oh, gets too much, she's there to balance him or whatnot. Because there was a scene in the apartment where he got mad because he found out that she's not even in Freeland. He was upset. I'm talking stuff started shaking and all that. And Jennifer got scared. Jennifer was like, oh, you scared me. Uh, then he just passed out. And we pretty much, you know, we pretty much find out that, um, you know, they, they, they balance each other or she balances him. It, just like a black woman. Here to balance a black man. But anyway, man, check this out, man. So, you know, Jefferson Pierce, you know, Black Lightning, he didn't turn on the ASA. So that's a problem. So since they turned on the ASA, Lynn is now in uh, harm's way because they know that they really can't do nothing with Black Lightning, so they got to get Lynn. So Lynn, you know, again, be like, hey, we got to get you up out of that, Lynn. So Lynn trying to get her stuff together. She grabbing all kind of green light because she addicted. She grabbing cures, and she trying to run out the uh, joint and... Uh, Uncle Gamby just grabs her, like, hey, get in. She drops her purse with the green light. And I said, I got to get my bag. Just sound like a crackhead and all that. And, you know, Uncle Gamby's like, man, ain't no time, man. We got to go, man. Your life in danger. But anyway, man, check this out. And before that scene took place, um, we, uh, my boy, uh, Uncle Gamby got word that Black Lightning was out here, you know, fighting for the people. And, you know, Anessa's good now. She ain't dying no more. And Uncle Gamby was like, hey, you go handle that. I'm going to be over here handling this here. And Anessa was finna try to run out there as Blackbird, which I prefer over Thunder. Thunder could be a little corny. Blackbird kind of gangster, man. But um, Uncle Gamby was like, I think Thunder would look better with Black Lightning. Then she... You know, she smiles, you know, and puts on the Black Lightning suit. Because uh, it's a big thing. We haven't seen, or excuse me, we haven't seen the Thunder suit in a while. But Blackbird been killing the game. But then she had to go out there and fight that boy Painkiller again. She's like, this cat again, I ain't going to let him touch me. But she beat the brakes off that boy this time, man. She beat the brakes off that boy, you know, and her and uh, my boy Black Lightning saved the day. Braxton looked like he pretty much had the same power as Black Lightning. He's like, okay, I'm gonna go head to head with Black Lightning. And they do their power thing and 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 Black Lightning like, you know, uh Braxton like, yeah, yeah, you know, I got the same power with you, I'm gonna get with you. And Black Lightning like, you don't have a suit though to kind of balance you out. And he's like, point taken. Then he passes out, man. But you know, pretty much after that. Carter and my boy Black Lightning look at each other. They're like, look, we done saved Miss Stafford's apartment. Now let's go save the city, baby. You know what I'm talking about? But y'all know what it is. Black Lightning, season three. This is like episode eight, man. Ne new episode next week, man. But y'all know what it is, man. After the episode, I'm coming with that content because that's what I do, man. But y'all know what it is. Bread Tuck Rob, Bread Tuck Legacy. Y'all move to take it easy. H-Town all day.